guys, welcome to a collective nail art haul. I'm going to do this video shop by shop and the first store is my favorite, it's dailycharm.com and I bought some nail art items two times there in the last few months and yeah, I'm going to show you what I got. I wanted to have such stone a long time and I bought five different kinds and I did some nail art using a few of them and I showed a photo on Instagram. I didn't um, film a nail art tutorial yet though. I think that these are super pretty and special. I think it's very awesome to work with real stone. And this is how it looks um, inside of each thing. You get different sizes of stones and depending on the um, stone, the sizes are different. For example, the white ones seem to be in general bigger than these ones. And I also bought these nail decals. These are water decals and I already used one as you can see. And I think that these are super cute and that's why I got them. Next I bought some studs. Um, those are the same ones. I just bought two packages to have more. I bought some triangles, um, some of these, I don't know how you call this shape, oval. And some teeny tiny round ones. I used to buy these things from in the nail room, but in the nail room closed, so it's important for me to be able to share with you where I got them, because some of you really like to buy the things I have. Daily Charm has awesome studs as well, so I'm going to share these from now on. Then I also got um, some charms. I bought the moons because I'd like to do a sailor moon design. I'm planning to do a sailor moon design since years and I haven't done it yet. But yeah, hopefully one day I'm going to do it. And I also bought cute bows and yeah, mainly bows as you can see. And I ordered um, two times at Daily Charm, which is super stupid because um, of the shipping price. But yeah, I ordered two times and every time I get a little gift, which is super sweet. So um, the second time I got these, these dots, which are very fun for summer. And then I got these charms with my first order, which is very nice. So thank you Daily Charm if you're watching. Next I got the three super special and unique um, polishes from Daria Nail Paint. These came in from France and I think they are super adorable. They were sent to me and I'm going to swatch each of them and tell you a little bit about them. The first one is this pink, has a white base and some pink um, glitter pieces or... Well, that's not glitter, but it has some pink pieces in it. And as you can see, it covers the nail very well in two coats. So it's very opaque, what I really like about this polish. Next, I got this chocolatey polish. And this is like the reason why I really wanted to have these polishes, because I'm very fascinated about such very special polishes. I have another um, chocolate inspired nail polish from Canmake, which I showed you a different time um, in my Japan haul video. And I'm thinking about doing a video about such polishes, because I think they're so fun. This was also easy to apply and I didn't place the chocolate pieces individually but with such polishes you can always take a toothpick and then um, put some of the pieces individually if you like to. I think that this distributed the chocolate pieces over the nail very well. This is the last polish I got from Daria and this was actually the least opaque one. I think I added three coats but the color is very gorgeous and if you like you can always go ahead and add a white base which will give you another color payoff. I also did a nail art using this. I didn't film it, I just had fun doing it without filming but I'm going to post a photo on Instagram later this week or next week. So those were all the three polishes. I think they're all very pretty. I can't really pick a favorite because they are so different. You can't really compare them. But if I had to, I think I would pick the chocolate one because that's just a very fun polish. Thank you very much, Daria, for sending me these polishes. I'm super excited to use them. 
Next I also went to Born Pretty Store and picked up a few things. I do have a coupon code for Burn Pretty Store, so check out the info box below if you're interested. So the first thing I got are those colorful micro beads. I think these are super fun, especially for summer, I guess, because of the of those colors, but also for the other seasons. I saw these pastel seashells and I fell in love with them and I had to have them and now I have them, but I not really sure what I'm going to do with them, maybe with a white base and then do an arrangement in the cuticle area. I'm not sure yet, but I'm going to use them in summer anyways because I think this is more of a summer product. I have been seeing these huge um, round shaped pearls, not the flat back ones, but the round shaped ones on Instagram and I thought they looked so pretty. So I saw these on Born Pretty Store and I bought them. I originally I originally ordered another color but they were out of stock so they gave me this color which is okay as well but I'm not hugely in love with it. The pearls are a lot smaller than I thought well I could just have measured them out but I'd like to have like huge pearls so I have to go ahead and search again for bigger pearls although they're smaller than I expected them to be. I like them very much and I think they are pretty and I can't wait to use them. Then I also got some of these teeny tiny studs. You might be wondering what the difference is between those cheap ones from Born Pretty Store and the more expensive ones from Daily Charm. Um, they're pretty similar but here you have a lot of um, ugly ones in between so I have to pick out the ones which are perfect and here you have a lot more perfect studs in it if that makes sense. Born Pretty Store also sent me two random things. Um, the other one, the other things I all bought myself, and those two things they sent me. These are some nail art stickers, which are very cute. And these are some awesome nail decoration pieces. We have a lot of different things in here, which are super fun. So the last um, brand is not exactly a haul. I got a Christmas um, calendar where you can open a door each day until it's Christmas and I got it from this brand Alessandro and um, usually I have the Ciate calendar and I wanted to say a quick quick impression slash review. I got it from my sister. So it's not yet Christmas, so I haven't opened all the doors. I believe I have opened 20 doors and those are all the um, nail polishes which were in there. They're super pretty. I tried out those three. This is the one I'm wearing right now and I think they are pretty. I have owned two Alessandro polishes before and they are awesome. So the quality of these polishes is very good. Those are the mini sizes I believe because my the one I had was a lot bigger. And those are all the nail um, care products which I got so I'm very happy about those but I, I don't know they, these just look like samples to me and you know you get one of these a day and I'm not very happy about these because they just look like samples and in the Ciate calendar you get a polish each day or something for nail art you do get a w one base and top coat though but that's fine but I think it's a lot of nail care items and I just think that I don't know I just think that these are these are fun and these are cool, but it's not as much, it's not as fun as getting some nail art or nail polish pieces. And it's quite a lot of nail care products compared to the nail polishes. So all in all, I'm not sure if I would um, splurge on such a calendar next year. It would be very interesting to know which nail polish brand does your favorite calendar. I believe OPI has one too. I have never had a OPI one. I would really love to know which calendars you like. So this was the haul. Thank you so much for watching. Also I'm trying to link everything I can find in the info box below. So make sure to check out the info box below for the links to the polishes and the nail art items. I hope you enjoyed this although it was not a huge haul. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye! If I forget my wallet, if I forget my pencil case, I just recently put this in here because university materials, cups, um,
case. I got it from Nordstrom. It was on sale. I got